Local car dealerships and stores say they're now being affected by the United Auto Workers strike. They say they have to take extra measures to make sure business continues to run smoothly. They told our Stoker Y Zork about the circumstances they now face. He's live with the details. Stoker. Sean, car dealers say the effect for them is delayed, but it will most certainly be felt. Auto parts stores telling a different story. Dealers that weren't willing to go on camera told me about the timing that these effects will start to show. That being the following season for shipments of cars. Manager of BJ Mauer Ford, Luke Mauer, says preparation ahead of time is already paying off due to parts and shipments being harder to order in a timely manner. He says his dealership is doing well and the effects of the strike shouldn't be drastic, if at all. In a lot of cases, you have to kind of prepare for them and be proactive rather than reactive. And in this case, uh, we knew that the contract was ending and we knew that there was probably going to be a strike coming. So beforehand, what we did was we kind of stocked up on some parts that our customers so heavily rely on. Auto parts store managers say they cope with times like these by preparing shipments ahead of time. They say their stores will be affected much quicker than a full size car dealership. We're, we're still getting you know, some of those parts that are sitting in warehouses and places that aren't available to be shipped because of the strike. When cars come in and get disassembled, we are starting to see some parts that we need. We're being told, you know, we can't get them until the strike ends. Reporting live in Cambria County, Stoker Wysorek, 6 News.